welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to show you how to complete the Why Not Potberry Wine Delivery Service quest. To unlock this quest, you need to go to the Drunken Goose and talk to Goose. He will then ask you to bring 24 bottles of Potberry wine. Next, I'll show you how to make this. Walk over to the winemaking area, which is right beside the Drunken Goose. When you click it, you'll be able to see the recipe for the bottle of potberry wine. You'll need 24 potberries, 10 cooking mix, and 3 honey per bottle. If you don't have the ingredients yet, go to Bucks Galore to buy what you need. Once you're inside, click the counter and buy the cooking mix. You're going to need 240 cooking mix to complete this challenge. This is going to cost you 2,400 coins. Next, you will have to buy some potberry seeds. To complete this quest, you will need 576 seeds. Since they're one coin each, this will cost you 576 coins. For the last ingredient, you'll need to collect some honey. If you're unsure of how to get honey, please check out my other YouTube video to show you how. Here, you'll see I'm collecting three honey from my beehive. To complete this quest, you'll need at least 72 honey to make 24 potberry wines. Luckily, I have more honey stored away in my chest at the Drunken Goose. Now I can focus on getting my potberries and I'll show you how to farm those now. Once you do get to a farm with empty soil, go ahead and plant your potberry seeds. Make sure you have enough energy as it's going to cost a lot just to plant water, and shear those. As you can see, I had to repeat this process many times. At one point, I even had to go buy energy drinks. I think I bought a total of six or seven. Energy drinks are quite expensive as they cost 1,000 coins just to replenish 50 energy. If you don't wanna do this, you might have to wait a day or two just so that you could complete this challenge. Here is an example of me running out of energy. Once you get too low, you won't be able to shear the potberries and you'll start walking very slow. At this point, you want to either replenish your energy for free at the sauna or buy some energy drinks. Even if you go to the sauna, it's likely that you won't be able to replenish enough energy to complete the full challenge. If you're like me and you don't want to wait for your energy to replenish for free, Go ahead and buy some energy drinks if you have enough coins. Even though I only bought two here, I did come back a few times to buy a total of maybe four or five more just to make sure I could complete this challenge. Once you have enough honey, cooking mix, and pot berries, you can go ahead to the winemaking area to make the pot berry wine. Pot berry wine takes one minute to make. Go ahead and repeat this 24 times. After each one is done, go ahead and click collect, and if you need to, you could create another one. Once you have all 24 bottles, go to the Drunken Goose. Once you're inside, you could complete the Wine Not Potberry Wine Delivery Service quest just by talking to Goose, who's behind the bar. I have my 24 potberry wines, so I'll go talk to him now. Once you complete the quest, you'll get 4,560 coins. To be honest, I'm not sure if it's worth all the effort. Just to buy the potberry seeds and the cooking mix, it was already close to 3,000 coins. On top of that, you expend a lot of time and energy making the ingredients to complete this quest. He does also give you two bottles to keep for yourself. Out of curiosity, I went ahead and used the potberry wine on myself to see what it does. And here you'll see that it gives me 77 energy. And that's all the information you need to complete the Why Not Potberry Wine Delivery Service quest. If you thought this video was helpful, please smash the like button, leave a comment, and subscribe to my channel. I hope to see you on the next one.